I don't know if you can see my screen because there's a lot of fire coming over here. Okay. And our okay. next topic. Okay. Okay. What's up? Who becomes the daddy when the father is not present? Mm. Who becomes a daddy mm. when the father is not present? So, Kane, I want you to start. Okay. Okay. With this. I, I, from what I, you know, it just depends on the situation, I guess, you know, with the mother. Um, you know, if the mother is, you know, remarried or something like that, then, you know, the stepdad will be that father figure. Um, but what usually happens, and it's kind of Let's crazy, go. what usually happens is these kids tend to go out into the world and look for a father figure, meaning it don't even have to be somebody that's, you know, old enough to be their father. It can be somebody that's just older. And they look up to them. So you have some of these teenagers that are going out there. And, um, you know, let's say, for instance, you got a, a 12 year old and he doesn't have his father in his uh, life and uh, mom is taking care of him. Mom can't be the father, guaranteed. She can only be the mother. So can she try? No, 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 not at all. Not at all. Not at all. That's my perspective. That's, that, that's my perspective because there's no way that she can be able, she can be a mother. But she can't be a father. Mm -hmm. So what the child is going to do is go out there and seek it from an outside source. Meaning sometimes they go into gangs, and that's that father figure, man. It, it, it looks hot, it, or this drug dealer, or somebody that's on the corner. You know, like you you, you yeah. tend to find those uh those individuals in your community, and then you kind of latch on in some kind of way. And that's where I see that you know a lot of these uh, kids are. Or, you know, they're yearning for the father. Now, I don't know, maybe the father's in jail, maybe the father's passed away, maybe the father's just not present. And he decides to go his separate ways from the uh, from the mother, but leaves the child behind. That happens sometimes too. Um, but he's still gonna yearn for the father, his yeah. biological father. Now, if there's a, a instance where the actual child uh, has the stepdad because the mother remarried. That's nice. That's a good influence, especially if he's a great, you know, uh, provider and things of that nature. But however, he's still going to yearn for the father. And what happens? And I, I'll let you speak. So, and what happens with the um, the mother is, mm -hmm. you know, they tend to dictate who they think the father like figure should be. So, if they feel like the actual father is not up to par, then they try to sometimes, not always, this is not all cases, but they'll pull that child away from me or, or try to keep that child away from their father. Because in all actuality, we as fathers, we want the best for our kids no matter what. No matter what. And a lot of times being a father really shapes you and molds you and bring you back to realization of what life is really about. When you do have that child, so Kane, let me ask you this question. Let me interrupt ahead, because you ahead. made that statement. Okay, what if a mother sees that that father that she knows is no good, mm -hmm. and he does come around? Hey, let me see the kid or whatever, mm -hmm. you know, and take him to Burger King or whatever. But mm -hmm. knows he still is no good, mm -hmm. and he's doing things that you know maybe in, into illegal activities or mm -hmm, whatever mm -hmm. she knows him or whatever he knows himself now should she protect that kid by saying hey until you change some of your ways mm -hmm. you're not going to see your son how do you feel I, about I, that i i know that the the uh, mother really wants to have the best interests and that mm -hmm. that father you know uh, well, I guess it would start all the way back to who she chose to even lay down with, right? It would start. Okay. So she, he didn't just start selling dope after, you know what I mean? Like after the right, child right. was born. That's nothing new. This is something that he'd been doing. So she was dealing with a bad boy. So now you just put your child in a predicament where you have to keep him away from him now that you got pregnant by somebody that you don't even condone their activities, right? So it's, a, it's like... Now you setting the child up for failure. So I get it why she pulls him away. She knew he was bad, but she still slept with this guy. Right? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, she still slept with him, so and ha- and got pregnant by. Him. So you know, like let's let's start with the foundation. Like if if that person is not conducive to be a father in your eyes, from the woman's perspective, then why are you doing these reckless acts? Yeah, you know. Now that is the fact. Like, oh, he's born now. It's time to keep him away. So okay, I get it. But he's still gonna yearn for that for his father. Now, my yeah. she's gonna dictate when and how long and the circumstances for that, right? She's gonna end up doing that. And then he's not gonna have that connection with the child to settle himself down. So he's gonna continue to do those things when if he was around them a lot more, they were probably like, you know what, man, I need to stay away from this guy. You know what I mean? I got my child. Right. You know what I mean? That kind of humbles a person versus every every now and again. Then it's just like, right. all right, I'm just the one who go buy the gear at the at the foot locker and then I ride out. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, that dinner, and then he back to dinner, the, back yeah, to his no. old ways again. But I'm telling you that it'll humble the uh the, the actual father. In the comments, y'all, in the comments, let me know how you feel about that. About my opinion. Well, I mean, I may be wrong. I can be wrong. And no, you also, said a lot of good points. Yeah, according to some of these people, hey, I've been wrong on a lot of different things. But but that's fine. Well, that's fine. That's my opinion. That's my and you have yours. And we want you to help. Yeah. We want to uh use our platform so you can express yourself too. You know? Yeah, so, yeah, definitely. But uh right. Kay, I would just say this. Uh mm-hmm. we know, and I'll just say in our community, and it can happen in a lot of people's community, mm-hmm. uh when the father is not there. So many different circumstances. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Uh, but when he's not present, the mother usually, she should try to find a, a good influence, a good man. Mm-hmm. If it's a, a brother, her brother, yeah. uncle, yeah. that's good uh, to to influence. To, hey, take him. Yeah, you're going to take him fishing or whatever. Do that. That'd be good but for, you, but you for, know what, though, bro? for the son. You know what, though? Think about this and and think about the dynamic of a child being with their uh, mother and going to, I don't know, a family gathering. Right. And there's her brother, her cousin, uh, maybe even an uncle uh, or whatever. Right. And Uh we all know that there's a crazy uncle, crazy cousin, crazy whatever. Right. But they see it. Yes. A hundred percent. And are interacting with it. Right. You don't kind of be like, oh, don't go over there to your family. You'd be like, well, he just crazy. But you, you know, because he's gonna do things. Oh, that my little nephew, whatever, here's some money, whatever. Mm-hmm. And he's doing crazy things or whatever. And they are maybe intrigued by this. Yeah. By this uncle or whatever. It's a family member, but it, you know, they intrigued by it. like he's different. I, I don't know other, you know, you, you can keep him around other people, but he gives us a good time. He's funny. People laugh on all that. You know what I mean? So now you kind of thinking like, I they don't want me around them. So now I, do I sneak around? You know what I mean? It's like, you know, you know when, when, when yeah, when when kids, you know, you said don't go over here, then they end up going over there. You know what I mean? So I I, I think that you know kids are going to be tempted for those uh, um, bad influences even within the family. Well, yeah. and that's a true statement. But you know, you as the the parent or whatever you you. <laughs> We don't went to family gatherings and get the brief. Okay, hey, you know your uncle crazy. Your uncle might say things, or he gonna be drunk and cutting up or whatever. Mm-hmm. Uh, he gonna give you some money. He might even try to tell you to sip some of that beer. Yeah, yeah, or whatever. Uh, no, don't do any of that. Mm-hmm. Okay, you come tell me. You get away. Mm-hmm. You brief him before, but I'm going back to if the the young lady, uh, the single mom, mm-hmm. uh, has. A, a good uncle, a good brother, yeah, yeah. or a, a, a good male uh, that's in her life that she knows or whatever that can mentor the kid. Okay, if she dates and you know get married and everything, hopefully that that stepfather is going to be a good role model in his life. And he will accept that kid as his own. 
Now, you said a child will usually yearn for their father. Yes. That is a true statement. Yes. But usually, if they to say the mom's got married and has a, a good man that, that cares and loves the kid, just like it's his own, he's going to uh, be in that kid's life and he'll take the place later on in life because the kid, you know, as long as the environment is suitable, nice, they'll grow up and they're a okay with the stepfather. But when they get a little older and they can understand more, they start thinking about my real daddy. Yeah, they my do. Real daddy. Why didn't he? Why didn't he come see me? What was the case? Mm -hmm. Now, 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 I'm now. So let's start with that point. That point you just said. Why? Why wasn't he there? That was okay, because that was that was that was because of the mother, right? The mother wait, 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 thought wait, wait, that he wasn't good enough. Reason. He wasn't wise enough to be around a child, so she came well, with that so, conclusion, right? Well, look, that's what I'm. We 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 don't discuss this many times. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm not gonna say just say that the the lady is keeping the the uh, father from. Well, the, we're just talking about the, the old circumstances because you just said. You, you brought up that circumstance where she think that mm -hmm. he's doing some bad things and the child doesn't need to be. Yeah, there. but that's Let's stay with yeah, that. that, just stay with that. Uh, well, if we're going to stay with that, yeah. yes. Now, you, you would explain that to the kid. You would explain it as he get older. You know, like I said, when they're young and she has a suitable, uh, she has a husband and everything's good. And then that kid's going to want to know still, hey, why did my father not come? Or why didn't you let me see him? She, then she can say, because of this, your dad's still doing the same things that he was doing when we were young, when we were in our early 20s or when we was teenagers. And you don't need to be a part of that, son. That's why I protected you. I protected you because I love you. And that's it. I hear you. That's all that needs I to be said. And then he can still see his... uh biological father when he's but on her you know but it'll be on her terms though it'll be on her no, terms you know, but you know especially when they're young older, or whatever and she yeah. thinks that he's a deadbeat for whatever reason but he wasn't a deadbeat earlier but now he'll deadbeat now because the child is here look, so, well i mean come on now we, we, we but we can't have it all what? both ways and, and when i say what i mean by that is okay yeah, true enough. They could have been young. He was, let's just go with the typical uh, drug drug boy. Mm -hmm. And she was in the life, okay? It was excited and everything. She ended up getting pregnant by the person, okay? Hey, I, I'm i going to have a kid. My life is going to change. I can't be around that. You don't think that yes, the guy was can around change it before. because of the kid? If he doesn't choose to change, the scenario I'm going with, he didn't change, Kane. But how do he how does he know that if she's not dealing with them? Come on, Consistent. people still talk. Word on the street. Oh, so okay, that's so all that, I'm just saying. That's how yeah, you, I'm just you determine if the child is going to be in his life because word on the street is that he's still doing it. And that, that, that's the reason. Is that's he the still reason why. doing it because or she can talk to him, Kane. I'm just saying we know if people are into that life or whatever, the streets will talk. Well, how okay? often? Well, tell me this. And, then. If, and that'll be that'll be that'll be if the father say, "Hey, baby, whatever. I'm not in that life anymore. I'm not doing those things. I do have a job now. I want to start being in my kid's life." And then if she keeps that kid away, that is on her, and then that is not right. Okay, that's it. I don't think it's that cut and dry. I just don't, I just but don't think it can be. It, it can be, but I don't think that she's going to be like, okay, you turn over a new leaf here. And here, here's your son. Here's your daughter. No. But hey, it I, has I, to I, be. Don't, I don't. I, I think that she, you gotta, she, you gotta she's being verify. protective. You got to verify first. Yeah, she, she's being protective. Verify. She's being protective. I get it. You know, mm -hmm. do, mm -hmm. doing her motherly, motherly duties. I get it. But I think that. The kids need to be in their lives. And I don't know what the statistics are. And in the comments, they can probably mm -hmm. hit us up or whatever. But I don't know what the statistics are. But how many how um how many times have you seen where the CPS comes to the father and he gets caught with something and they take it away, take the child away from the father at the time of the incident? 
Like, you know, like, like, say if they do a drug bus right, and, right, and then right, they take right. them, then who's the mother? And then they find out the mother. Oh, you was old. You had all him around all this or whatever. You know, how often does that happen? How often do you hear about that happening? Not often. But, 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 but this, this is the, the lifestyle that you're not, saying not, not, that this woman is keeping all. her child from. Do you think that he would say, all right, all. I'm going to keep my child at the dope house. I'm going to make sure that, you know, do you think that that's what the uh, this this uh, father is going to do? Yeah. Well, do you think the hey, father I has a it. child in the best interest, or he just playing playing that? He just like come on <laughs> over or whatever. If that was the case, then he just don't well, even deal with them. Well, look, real story had a, a friend, um, and her baby's father, you know, was into the life, mm -hmm. and he wanted to get the kid and take the kid near places where that just goes on drugs and everything and people they fight all of that stuff so why would she allow she said nope you're not no i'm not bringing them over there we can go meet at a park but he just wanted to show his son off to his boys because mm -hmm. it was just every blue moon but he was still in the life and i can't fault my friend for saying no you, you can't see the kid if you want to take him right back to the neighborhood where you have been physically hurt mm -hmm. and everything so, so you think i was, was i was for that so so you think that he was just um making bad decisions oh yeah he was making yeah, definitely yeah, bad yeah. decisions and, 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 he, kind of he, he met at the park a couple of times he made it to park a couple of times mm -hmm. uh to see his son and everything yeah. so i mean that and that worked out well but those are scenarios where where that happens. Look like we lost. Uh, I can hear you, my man. boy Kane, because the heat. You gotta <laughs> you gotta connect because the heat was getting too hot for him. And sometimes that happens. It happens. I don't know about all that. I don't know about all that. Uh, but I, I will say this: why uh -huh. why are you doing that? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead, I go ahead. am for, and I said it many times for mothers and fathers okay it can't be about the two of y'all arguing against each other and just because he got a new lady or she has a new man no it's about the kid that y'all created that we got to reach the kid yeah. that you created and go about your ways because i'll be in the youtube streets okay and i've seen so many videos where the the baby mama is upset with the father because he has a new girlfriend and she might call the police and say different things. And now it's just a silver matter. And that's usually with the younger people, but we got to get out of that because the kids are both of y'all future. Y'all created together. So we got to do right by the kid. So, so, so I, I guess my final thought with this, man, um, I guess you can say, you know, like when it comes to, you know, a child and not having a father, the father needs to be there. I think the yes. father needs to be there full time. If not, you say the best thing that they, that they have or whatever, they're still going to yearn for their father. So if the father is not there full time. And he's not passed away or anything like that. He still needs to be a part of the child's life because the child is going to yearn for that father. And and maybe the 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 right answer is to hey, I need you. I need the uh, mother to be there and uh, sift through who needs this child needs to be around in order for that to happen. Especially because of your example, you said you knew a guy that just you know had his child around in, in the wrong neighborhoods and things of that nature. But I I, I think overall uh, they you know. The uh, the father is not going to put their uh, child in harm's way, and I'll stick with that. And I'll stick with that. So yeah, have the best you know uh, option for the child, but make sure the child has a father if the father is living and around. Yeah, I, I agree the same thing okay. that you said. And I'll just make it real quick. Uh, mothers, uh, like he just said, you need to have the father in the kid's life. Fathers, you need to do everything you can do to be in your kid's life. That's period, because both of y'all created 
that mm-hmm. individual. Yeah. So regardless of who, if she has another man or he has another woman, it is about the child you created together. Yeah. That's it, point blank. All right, that's my final thoughts. For sure, that's it. Hey, look, that's the uncomfortable truth in the comments. Hit yeah. us up. Hit us up. Let yes. us know how you feel about this. I, I want to hear your opinion. We'll go back and forth and have this conversation offline. All right. Hey, hey, man. For sure. Roger. Let's go. Roll, tide, roll. You know, if you don't want to see us, but you want to just listen to us, we on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon, Pandora, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts, all of them.